the Rebel Pop R. Just changed the hooks. That's a Gamagatsu triple grip on the back and a number four round bend on the front. Uh, that might be a number six. Boy, that smally tug. I was not popping it, I was walking it. And he smashed it. A big fish. That was easy three and a half. Well, I'm one for three this morning. I just missed another one. Oh, there's one, there's one, there's one, there's one. There's one. Oh. Man, he's strong. Man, he's strong. Look at the look at the stripes on him. <sighs> nice little male, beautiful fish. He smashed it. Rock bass. They seem to like me walking this thing. I'm walking it just like you would a, a spook or a Sammy. I had three blow ups this morning and missed all three of them. The third one, I guess, could have been a bass, but I'm assuming it was something with teeth because it, when I set the hook, it sliced me off clean. So I lost that one. Could have been a pickerel because it took my pop R away. So I'm going to go rig up another one. Pickerel right here. We do catch them, but not a ton. Um, and I have a feeling that that's what, unless I had a bad spot in the, in the leader, the fluorocarbon leader. Pretty much all my fishing is done with, with braid, either, either Cortland Master Braid or... You'll see a lot of my rods have the yellow or the, the bright green uh, suffix. I think it's 832 or 532. That is by far my favorite of all the Superline categories. Good visibility, you can get it in multiple colors. It's round, it casts the best, um, it doesn't win not, but I like. Everybody will tell you something different. I use braid pretty much on all applications and I use it on my, on my top water. I like the instant. Um, no stretch hook sets so yesterday I was I was walking the popper which is a little unusual but, and just making a disturbance on the surface and they were they were crushing it this morning I've done a little of both and there's just not much going on this morning um, I have seen quite a few fish blow up and I keep casting to the to the rings but I haven't had any takers if you're out fishing in the lake or in big water big area sometimes that that got to chug it hard and, and get it to spit so it calls those fish in so anyways that's going to do it for today thanks everybody for watching uh, i love top water if i can eat get them if i can get anything to eat on top i will I, I would much rather fish the top than the bottom of the water um 
I mean, I do it all, obviously. We're, as fishermen, we, you know, we're, we're forever flexible. Large mouth, small mouth. Believe it or not, I've caught walleyes on, on top water. Uh, the little small poppers for, for panfish are always fun. Bluegills, sunnies, rock bass, they're not shy about eating off the surface at all. Obviously trout when you, when you have the opportunity. Frogs, poppers, wake baits. As always, thanks for watching. And remember, keep your tip up.